Hi ladies, I'm here with a little haul um, from a couple different places. Um, I'll start with uh, my Stampin' Up! haul. I finally got these two punches for cards, for sentiments. Um, this one is the Word Window Punch. And you can layer it with this one or use it separately. And this one is the Modern Label Punch. So, finally got those. And I got these buttons here. And there are 72 pieces. Um, they're the Brights collection. So, I don't know if I can open it and you can see. I think there's three or four different styles. And maybe six, six colors, I think. So, I don't really have any buttons, so these are good to have now. Slowly building up my collection of things. Um, this ribbon I used in my last um, video. It's the ribbon pleated satin. Um, you get five yards, three eighths inches, and it's really pretty. I think it came in four colors in their mini, and I have the pink in this one, which is Baja Breeze. There's two other colors, which I need to decide if I'm going to get or not. It ends this month in their mini catalog. Um, I also got the Baker's Twine Pool Party. Really pretty color. And I got these matching... Um, these are called the Edgelet Adorning Accents. And they look like this. So you can edge your cards with the die. And they came with matte, well, didn't come, I bought them separately. Um, the Textured Impressions Embossing Folder. And it comes with three, and then those two match the dies. And then there's this uh, heart one. So they look like, they look like this. So I got those to match. And I also bought this, which I've tried and I'm not sure if I like it or not yet. It's the Big Shot Die Sizzlets Large Paper Doily. I thought it would come out really, really pretty and I do like the pattern. But I've tried three different times with my cuddle bug to cut it. Now it imprinted on this side, but you can hardly see it on the back so it's not punching it all the way through. And then you have to kind of poke it out. And then I tried this one. And again, I don't know if you can see. It didn't cut all the way through. So I'm going to have to play around and figure out. It's the best one that I did. But again, get it to focus. It didn't cut all the way through. So I'm not sure if you need the big shot to use this die. I mean, I should be able to use the cuddle bug, but. It's not seems I'm using the two B plates with the A plate. So if anyone else has used this, maybe they can tell me what I've done wrong. But I'll have to play with that some more. So that's all I got from Stampin' Up. And then I went to the dollar store, um, Dollarama here in Canada. And I picked up some of these uh, butterflies. Um, butterfly picks. So I picked them up in purple. So I thought they were pretty to put on cards or a layout. So I got them on in purple, pink, and like a baby blue. And then I picked up some, a different color in these that I picked up last time. So I thought they were really pretty. And then I just picked up um, some pink pearls that I was running out of and some more blue ones. And then I also found these in the flower section. So 
kind of sprays. They have these plastic crystal type, um, I don't know if I can focus it, butterflies. So they had a few colors, but this time I only picked up uh, pink and blue. So get to focus. Those are really pretty. So there's it's wrapped up in like a string goes right through it, so you can put it on a stick pin or something. Get to focus. Then I found these. And they're supposed to be push pins, but they look like buttons. So I thought I could use those. Okay. I had two different packs. So I thought those were kind of pretty. And I picked up some yellow ribbon. I don't have any, so I thought for spring, yellow would be a good color to have. And I got some more wood things to alter my... I got this one for my son. He wants to craft with me. So I got that one. It's like a lizard. He loves animals. And then I got a dragonfly that I could alter. So these are pretty heavy wood. So I'll have to figure out how to mount it on the wall or something. And then I picked up another butterfly for myself. So hopefully Maybe in another month or so, I'll be able to place some orders online from some Etsy stores and I Am Roses or Wild Orchid Crafts or something. And I've got this box from the dollar store too. I wanted to alter. So, so that was that. And I went into our winners that we have here in Canada. And I found a couple more of these Want to Scrap mini bell albums. I picked up this one. It's like it's four pages. I think they're different sizes. I haven't taken it out yet. And then I bought this scallop circle one. And they're only $3.99. And it comes with the rings. So I thought that was pretty too. So that's all I bought. Um, Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys later.